Hey, my people. I'm my name is Princess Banigo, and I'm a Nigerian content creator based right here in Lagos. Yes, guys, so we've been analyzing an editorial's former help dropped a video three weeks ago, guys. That video was three weeks ago. Please watch this video with a clear mind, and let's analyze and see if this girl is actually lying, and then I'll leave my thoughts at the end of the video. She was actually working here, and I was paying her salary. You guys should know that Editora did not tell us the amount she was actually paying the girl. And let's just continue. But she work as, as a cleaner in where the, in, in a laundry shop. I've worked as a cleaner in the bank. I've worked, like I've literally worked in so many places and with very small money. Let's actually discuss how much they actually pay out helps in Nigeria. Most of the times, really guys, um, I think the ranges from like 20,000 to 50,000 really um if you're working in very very high class places maybe like lekki or so i'm talking with lagos experience now maybe it might get to like a hundred or more but in lagos let's just say from 20 25 30 depending if you're living help or not so is editorial really paying that girl a very very small amount of 15,000 Mm, with the kind of work the girl is doing, knowing fully whether it's only the girl washing clothes, cleaning, and everything, 15k smosha, and it is game money. So let's continue. She worked here and then um, she was basically doing um, some of the chores, like cleaning the place and, of course, cleaning the kitchen and all of that stuff. Kindly note that Editora did not mention washing of clothes. Yes, she didn't mention washing of clothes. She just said cleaning and you know clean the kitchen and mopping the house okay let's continue when she came at first to work here i was thinking she was going to come and go that was actually my my agreement you know with her initially she was gonna come work and go you know so when i was actually interviewing her i was telling her okay you're gonna work and go and then your office is gonna be weekends then she she now asks me if she can stay. So when I called her, then she directed me to the place I came. So we discussed everything at once. First, she told me that she's going to pay me 15k monthly, and this is my job: washing, mopping, this, that. That she told me that we also have a washing machine. That that one's food has been an issue. So when I asked her, but since my house is far. I'm coming from what you from my supply to your budget. I was like, Ma, this can I stay? And I said, okay, if you want to stay, no problem. For her, leaving Saturday and Sunday was actually not among the plan of she living in my house for 15k. If I put her inside it to do anything, definitely the money will go down. So that was the reason why I said, please, ma, I want to be going on. Go on Saturday and Sunday. So she said that Saturday I need to help in doing this. Okay, fine. I said go on Sundays. That was when I used to go out to my and to shop to do some work. Yes, I accepted that she stays. If you're staying here, you want to go out on Saturday. Where will you be going to? She said she'll be going to her auntie's place. Okay, and she was actually going to that to this lady's shop because the lady sells some hair, you know, stuff and all. now. There's, there was this first incident that happened here in the house. You know, I was actually sitting in the in the in the parlor, and and she was, and I heard their voice. She and Elizabeth in my room, and I now came. I just came inside the room. I literally saw this girl lying down on my bed. That I that she saw me her matrimonial bread laughing. Me, I'm a playful person. I mean, none of my ethnic is there. It's only small, small children like um, Helen and Elizabeth. So, as we are playing, you can even still ask them. Then she pushed me to the bed. I know so she have warned me because I never ever sit on that bed, talking more of to lie down since I've been working with her. I swear with God, I've never. I ask her, excuse me, why are you on my bed? And she was like, oh, Lizzie, Lizzie, Elizabeth pushed her. And I'm like, Elizabeth pushed you? And Elizabeth is not lying down on my bed. Helen is not lying down on my bed, but you are the one who's lying down and you were, you were so happy. 
you know, so I kind of quarrel her about that. Evans, lie down or maybe just go forward now because I warn you that this, this is joy, this is my matrimonial bed. Please don't sit down, not even to lie down on it. So, um, because we are playing, I don't even know, I don't even expect it. So she pushed me. She, when she pushed me to the bed, that was when she come in. I say, so Joy, I have to go to so, Like in her bed, was like, no man. We are playing and she pushed me. She came inside our room and she hit me. Because of, I don't know, she, she hit me. Yes, I'm here, yes, she hit me. Because of all this thing, I kept calm. I gave my husband food and then my husband did not actually eat that food. He only took, I think, one, one small fish out of the soup and then, and then left the food. So I took the food to the kitchen. I heard her saying that I went and carried her husband's plate and was eating. That I did not have respect this, but as I came back, the hobby told me to go and carry out that food that he remained, that he had finished. Like if somebody finished food, go and carry that food. Okay, so she left and she was not present to help in cooking. You know, when I when she came back and I was like, okay, why is it that every every time, like, even if you want to leave on Saturday, on Saturday, you have to first of all help, okay, me by cooking this food so that at least when you come back you're gonna eat and not when you see me start cooking that is when you dress up and you want to go out and then you feel that you want to come back and just eat i mean so he has uh, finished eating so the remaining one i carried it because i was hungry so i carried it i came inside she took the food that my husband wanted to eat you know and then she sat down in the in the kitchen, I ate this food with the plate I used in serving my husband food. Do you understand? And then I was mad. I was like, even if you wanted to eat the food, won't you turn the food out from the plate that I used in serving my husband food? I agree with, with my parents. Even if when they finish eating food, then I'll give their plate. I'll carry it. The menu, I'll eat it. I'll not feel anything. You can't. Every other person respect that because that's that even if the, the place is not expensive but because of the value i place in it i use it to serve my husband food and my husband is the head of this family so he deserves that respect okay no other person uses that plate except me and then this lady this girl was just balancing i see eating the food and i'm like are you kidding me so i quarrel her and and then, and then I left. Okay. I, the line against me, I choose the one that said not much work safe. When she left, it was just one week after that she called me that she wants to come back. And I'm like, what is happening? And then she sent me this text, which I'm going to include it here. So you guys will see. When I, I sent her that text, when I called her, she didn't reply. That was when I came to her house to tell you another thing that she did. That was when I came to her house to beg her, ma, please. I'm sorry that I left. Is that that she should take me back? That's what I came to her house to tell her. She started vlogging me. She gave she gave somebody a camera to start vlogging me. Then she starts. Uh, make you another video of me again hopefully with these clips you've seen you can tell that this girl is not necessarily lying most of the things that Tora said you know maybe Tora has exaggerated it a little bit more you know the girl said it also the part editor did not come to tell us was the part whereby you know they took her to the police station which the girl now told us that they took her to the police station and this is my unbiased judgment in this matter joy you shouldn't have come back to editorial's house you wrote her you called her she did not pick you shouldn't have come back to her house you have no right coming to her house you know and editorial you had no right bringing your camera out since you didn't want her to come to your house she came you should have just told her leave my house you enter your house and you lock the door why did you now bring out your camera instead of vlogging now when she now wanted to bring her camera you people started beating her up you now took her to the police station you know do well for dear and joy your own you're not supposed to come back to her house this is my own judgment though i don't want this video to be too long that's why 
I just had to cut it here. I could put more clips of editorial saying more things and the girl also defending herself, but I mean, why not? But you guys can see that the girl is not really, really lying, right? With what editorial said. Uh -huh. So that is what I wanted to bring out in this video. Anyway, let's not call editorial devil. Oh, Satan or evil. Let's take it easy on her. And people are saying, now, why is the girl coming out now? This video is three weeks ago, as I said. And the girl was threatened, according to her, that they said she should not do any video, she should not do this, she should not do that. I beg, make a rest. Eh? I don't tell ya. Editoria, change. If you are really treating your health bad, please change. And if you are not treating them bad, and you feel you are your best character, change. I mean, although change, if you don't want to change. According to Editoria, she works in different places and they pay her small money. So maybe that is why she doesn't find it hard to pay small money to people also, because she was giving small money. Let us all rest. I beg, what is this matter? Anyway, guys, this might be my last video unless more things come outside and I'll be back here to analyze. And oh, the girl's channel is not a new channel. She has had the channel for a while. Yes, for those that are saying she rush, go open channel. She don't get the channel since. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you in another video. Bye for now.